ericmothersmother.com. In this video, I want to show you how we always have to spend some time looking at long-term monthly charts because sometimes they are actually the ones that give us clarity into what is going on. Here we can see GERN is having a drop this month of about, let's call it 14%, not a big drop, but I'll show you why this could be significant. And it is because if you take a look, this is a three-year monthly chart. What we see here is if we take a look at the longer view beyond this, we see that there's a reason why the stock is pulling back. So we can see the close here. In fact, it spent some time way above this, ended up closing the month here, and this month is down. Now, if you had been looking at the long-term monthly chart, this recent pullback is consistent with the resistance that the stock has established over a period of time. Take a look at the high there in 2000 and this high in 2013. If you draw a line connecting those two points, you see that we come to the recent resistance level. So even though, yes, the market can be confusing, lots of factors to consider but sometimes it makes sense to always take a look at the long-term monthly charts as we can see here we have a good example why this is pulling back because the stock has come back and is showing resistance in an area or on a line that has been a problem spot going back almost 18 years so the instruments we are trading have a tremendous memory so always good to check your long-term charts. Eric Mwadith, Mwadith As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E-S-E-S. Woo!